Hello YouTube, another video with Tiny Fog. But anyway, today I'm going to be showing you a mod called Single Player Commands. Which is pretty awesome. So first of all, I'm going to find the right stuff to do this in. But basically, obviously it's Single Player Commands. I hope that's obvious, at least. And there's not just slash give and stuff. You don't even have to type slash. So right here, press D. Uh, that's, uh, that's from the multiplayer game I was just in. But this is not multiplayer, I'll show you. Single player, world 2. Building terrain, come on. Build terrain. Hurry up. Hurry up. Come on. You can do it in Minecraft. Yep, there we are. So this, then I can type slash descend. Oops, I spelled it wrong. Ow. Slash ascend. And also slash, or you don't even have to type slash. Give 164 gives you stone. You have to use the data values. Uh, Give 331 64 gives me 300. I mean 64 redstone. Redstone is has the ID of 331. And these are all the commands. Uh, you can damp slash damage. So now I can't take damage. Damage now off. Uh, you can teleport. You can uh, spawn. Set your spawn. You can. There's a lot of stuff you can do, and it's sweet. So now I'm going to show you how to install it. I'm not going to delete my slash bin folder because I have some other mods installed that I don't want to just delete. But anyway, when you download it, it should give you a folder titled parenthesis one. And in it, it should be bz.class, playerhelper.class, readme.txt, and a net folder. So anyway, you uh, go into the description, and I know this didn't work for a lot of people sometimes, but this is how it's done. You copy only the first part of code. Okay. The last line is Minecraft.jar and the first line is CD. You copy only that, okay? Go into the little search icon thing, type in terminal, and paste it in, and press enter. Okay, now you go into a new finder window. Go into mctmp under your username. There should be a bunch of .class files. So anyway, back in your uh, parenthesis one folder, press, click on bz.class, hold command, and click on playerhelper.class. Now copy these items, go down to mctmp, and paste them in. Replace them. Okay, you're almost done. Now in the parenthesis one folder, you go into net, Minecraft, client, and it should give you a minecraft.class. Now in mctmp, you find the net file, open it, go into Minecraft, and go into client, and then back in your uh, the mod class, you copy the minecraft.class and pay, uh, paste it into mctmp in this file. So now you should have minecraft.class and minecraftapplet.class. And then, go back to the description of this video, and copy the second part of this code, starting at rm meta inf mojing and ending at rm rf mctmp. Basically what that does is delete the meta inf folder and some other stuff, and paste it into terminal. mctmp folder should go away. You can get out of terminal. And now when you go into Minecraft, It should work. You you can press whatever your uh, whatever your chat key is and type a command. And if it says command not work and you think it's not working, it probably is because you were able to type something in single player. So anyway, thanks for watching. I hate having to play on Tiny Fog while recording, but another week maybe at the most. Seems like a really long time. Yeah, anyway, thanks for watching. Subscribe for more videos. Thumbs up, and I'll see you next time. Bye.